Good afternoon, Jackson. <laughs> How are you? Um, Today. <laughs> so, so this is, I'm gonna tell them and tell everybody what we made. So we made some orange mango immunity bowls with orange zest and apricot granola and then like hemp hearts. And it was supposed to also have- Hemp hearts? That's what they call it. Oh, weird. <laughs> yeah. And then it was also supposed to have like big Ew. pieces of orange, but I, I didn't read that part correctly. So I mixed all the orange into the like yogurt part. So mm. this part is orange, mm -hmm. mango, and ginger, mm -hmm. ginger and yogurt. So okay. this is what we're having. It's actually mm -hmm. lunchtime. We've already had breakfast, but I think this was supposed to be like a breakfast thing. Oh yeah, how is it? You're like those servers. Oh yeah, right when you put it in your mouth. I hadn't even finished my bite. What do you <laughs> think of it, Jackson? <laughs> was that water yummy? It's actually really good. Is it? There is a lot of like um, ginger flavor. Can you have some? You want to try it? Okay. Try it, please. Okay. Those are my glasses. I know I don't wear them very often, so you don't know what they are. Let me move this. Did you like it? He goes, hmm. He had like a weird look on his face, like, I don't know. It's immunity boosting, buddy. It's going to help you. I'm not giving him any of the granola part. Because yeah, that's too crunchy for him. Mm -hmm. I'm going to link this uh, recipe down below for you guys because I. I didn't show myself making it. I kind of wish I would have now because it's really good. How is it? Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, 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 you really that's want really some. Good. Isn't it delicious? Yeah, it's, it's pretty orangey. I think that's the immunity mm. boosting part, right, buddy? How did you say? I really think he's going to start talking any second now. And he sort of already has. He, he's like so trying though. Like he's, he's trying to He's been to make, watching my lips too. Well, and you've been trying to make words happen. <sighs> so yeah, this morning we just, I had to edit the Hollywood Studios video. So that took a little bit of time. So that, that took up most of the morning. We got some groceries delivered. We are gonna go to Target here in just a minute after we eat. Yeah, and then I think we're gonna try a keto meal tonight. Ooh. So this is all from Martha and Marley Spoon. I know we talk about them a lot, but this is the meal subscription box that we get. So that's kind of just what we're doing today is eating and going to Target. <laughs> just like a normal day. Nothing super exciting, but I want to get a splash pad for Jackson. So they sell like pretty inexpensive little splash pads at Target. And I want to grab one for him for the backyard because I think he will really like it. And I told you in the last home vlog that we were gonna have some friends over tomorrow. Tomorrow was Sunday. We were gonna have some friends over tomorrow and Jackson was gonna get to play outside with their son who's about the same age. And so I wanted to get the splash pad for them to play on so they could also have the pool and the slide and the splash pad. And I was gonna put the bubble maker out there and Jackson really loves this little uh, yogurt bowl, but they can't come tomorrow. We had to change the reschedule. So hopefully we're gonna do this again next weekend. But now, I tomorrow, I know you really like it. Mm -hmm. What? This. Mm -hmm. Is it this? The camera? Is it mm -hmm. this? Oh, what else did we get today? Mm -hmm. See, Daddy surprised you and me with this new little buddy hat. So you're gonna match Mommy and Daddy. Yeah, we have ours from the Clearwater Marine Aquarium. We got a lot of questions when you had that hat on. People were like, oh my gosh, I love that hat. Where did you get it? So we got ours at the aquarium, but I think you can really get them anywhere. Because yeah. even when we were at Vero Beach, they sold Vero Beach versions of the hat. Look at that. But the Clearwater Marine Aquarium is just better. Well, <laughs> when you purchase things from their gift shop, it goes directly back into the um, aquarium to help the animals. So yeah, we definitely felt good about buying it there. Yeah. But if you can't get to the aquarium and you want to get one, you can get them literally anywhere. On so Amazon. yeah, we got Jackson, a little buddy version. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> So I'm, excited for, I'm excited for him to wear it when we do our little backyard pool day next weekend. But what I was gonna tell you guys is that we have some friends and they invited us over for a traditional British, like English breakfast. I'm super excited. So when, well, when we were at Vero Beach, yeah, we're gonna do like a full English, which I, I, I can't wait. I think that's gonna be so fun. But they also were telling us about things that they eat that are like, like, just every we were day. About peanut butter and jelly. Yeah, okay. So so I was telling them how whenever we talk about peanut butter and jelly, we get comments where people are like, I can't believe you put jelly on a sandwich. That's so weird. And then we found out through you guys that jelly to you is the same thing as jello to us, which is why peanut butter and jelly is such a like a strange sounding sandwich. But then they were telling us that they eat parvel. 
Par parble? Bo Boble. Let us know in the comments down below, but it, he spreads it on bread with butter. So they're gonna get some of that for us to try. And then there was something else that we were gonna try, which was... We're definitely trying English bacon. Yeah, but there was another, there was another like thing to spread on bread that they were like, oh, we'll have to try this. Yeah. I can't remember. So we're gonna do that tomorrow. Okay, so Tim was right. It is bovril. 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 Mm -hmm. But then the other thing they wanted us to try was something relish. It was like cheese and onion, but it wasn't onion. No, no, no. You it put it, called, you put it, it on a cheese sandwich. It's not yeah. cheese. But we kept calling it relish, but they didn't call it relish. We were equating it to relish, but it's like chunks of onion. I think he said it was like carrots and... Yeah. If, if you know what we're talking about, leave it in the comments down below. I think it's really neat to do things that are like totally... Sorry, I'm trying to feed Jackson. That are totally normal for other people, but are just kind of like out of the ordinary for us. So that's what we're going to do tomorrow. It was called cheese and pickle. Cheese and pickle. But it's not actually pickle. Hey. That's right. Why we were yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. So it's called cheese yeah, and pickle. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know you like it. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give you some more. But it's it's called cheese and pickle because you put it on a, a cheese sandwich, but it's not. The Branston pickle is why it was called. Branston pickle. That's what it is. That was the name. Branston pickle. So we're going to have some Branston pickle sandwiches and poverl. Poverl. And Mo oh, Bovril, I don't know why I think it's a peep. So that's what we're doing. So there you go. We're very excited for tomorrow. But also today is just kind of a chill day. Hey bud. Okay. Are we putting our shoes on so we can go to Target? Where are your shoes? Yes, those are your shoes. All right, let's go. You ready? Yeah. Look at those shoes. Are those your dancing shoes? Are you doing, doing tap <laughs> dancing? Come on bud, let's go. We're going to Target. Let's go get in the car. Let's go buddy. We're going in the garage. Come on. Come on. This way. All right, bud. We're gonna go find something fun for the backyard for you. You ready? Don't tell him. I'll what, be a you... surprise. Well, surprise. Oh, jeez. <laughs> so here's a new one for me. Jackson disabled my phone. Can use it in one minute, which isn't so bad. You've never done that before, buddy. Uh, uh, no, I can't give you my phone now. You disabled it. it doesn't even uh, work. Uh, my phone. He just saw a plane go overhead because we have the the like open sunroof thing in the Tesla. Mm -hmm. I know, you saw that plane, was that so cool? I think my new favorite thing is that Jackson waves at everybody now. Oh yeah. And he goes, hi, hi, <laughs> hi. And it's so cute and he won't stop until they wave back. He's very persistent. Are you shaking the car? Whoa, we're going crazy. <laughs> wild buddy, a wild buddy has appeared. There's a shirt at Target that says American Original. It's got Goofy, Pluto, Minnie, Donald, Daisy, and Mickey. That's $15. And they got a Peanuts one right next to it with Snoopy and Woodstock. Living the dream. Some Star Wars stuff. We're in the kids section or the youth section right now. Got a Baby Yoda. Some more Disney stuff over here. Right next to, is this Five Nights at Freddy's or something? What is this? I don't know what this stuff is. Piggy. What is Piggy? Oh, I'm out of the loop. Oh, here's another Mickey Mouse right here. Oh, this one. This one's way cool. Oh, yeah. Wow, that's awesome. It's only $9. Do they have his size? I don't know. We'll see. Probably not. Oh, we no. might be able to get him like a one <laughs> or like an extra small. Maybe he'll fit into that. Nothing says America like Star Wars. <laughs> Grab this one, though. Is Jackson this your favorite it. one? Oh, check this out. They have a whole section of Pride merchandise uh, uh, for June. Oh, so they have a, a Pride Mickey Mouse here. Pride Golden Girls. So Melissa and Doug, who is a company that makes children's toys, has all of these different outdoor things for like, pretend like you could make uh, like pretend camp stove, pretend s'mores. I love this. There's like a fake fire too. Oh, they crank and crackle. And it's like fake marshmallows. I feel Whoa. like you should make your kids real s'mores after that though. Right? Oh, a fishing set? A yeah. cooler? Oh, and an RV. You just buy an RV. All right, Jackson, we gotta find you. It was like a water table activity thing that we were gonna try to find you. He loves the lights. He just keeps looking up at the lights. Oh yeah, I don't think I have it. It was like right here. Oh, I love this. Oh yeah, it's like a little wagon. Oh, it's a picnic. <laughs> it's a picnic for your bear. Oh, that's, that's the day the teddy bears have their picnics. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. All right, we're gonna see how Jackson does on this whale. Can you get your leggy over? Is the tail too tall? Do you like it, buddy? <laughs> What do you think, you stinky? I like how every time he tries a new toy, he's like, uh... Oh, this one. oh my goodness. 
We can have a foam party. Oh god. <laughs> Look at this. A foam mountain in minutes. I like the name foam mo. What is this? Whoa, I'm so dizzy. I feel like we found the water section. So this looks fun. Yeah. The dual twister. I feel like we need yes. to start them out with something easy to like begin with. This one? This magic flower water cable? Maybe, yeah. Uh, oh, here, look. This is like this tropical palm leaf right here. It's basically a splash pad. It's like a really shallow pool. Why didn't we have these things even when I was like a teenager? It's a fun noodle with a water gun attached to it. And the water just soaks up right through there underwater while you're sitting on it. Brilliant. Buddy, do you want to wear this shirt with cool rhinoceroses on it? Oh, I think it is pajamas. What does it say? It says diving into bed. Oh, okay. I didn't think they were pajamas. Yeah, I thought they were just like... I guess these are definitely pajamas. Oh, okay. Okay, so a lot has happened since our last clip. We are back from Target. I don't know if we showed you that we left Target. But we left Target. We'll show you what we got um, in uh, after dinner because we got some fun stuff that I wanted to show you. But I also wanted to show you dinner, so I didn't film any of it. Uh, sorry, I, I totally planned on filming it. And then it's just a little hectic, like with a toddler and like trying hot pans and trying to film everything and only cooking with one hand. So I didn't film the dinner, but I will the next time I will film dinner. So <laughs> I don't even know if it really matters to you guys, but I just wanted to... Um, show you what we made. So this is one of the keto meals. So this is a zucchini and green bean. They're calling it a salad. It's boiled green beans with sauteed zucchini. There's a like a vinaigrette on top, like a garlic vinaigrette with some Parmesan and chopped almonds. And then this is just some steak that we cooked. We kind of marinated it in the pesto. I cooked it in the cast iron and then we topped it with some more pesto. So this is a keto friendly meal from Marley Spoon. We haven't tried any of those, so we thought tonight we'd give it a go. So this looks delicious, this smells delicious. Um, Tim is upstairs giving Jackson a bath and then we're gonna switch off. I'm, I'm gonna eat and then I'm gonna put Jackson to bed so that Tim can come down and eat his dinner. So, we'll be back soon, shortly. All right, so that dinner was delicious. I really liked the green beans and I liked the fact that they had nuts in them and they had Parmesan on them. And then I liked the steak, it kind of had like a spicy flavor almost like whatever was in the pesto kind of had like a i think it was the garlic like really gave it a punch and i like that it was fantastic so now uh, we had gone to the pediatrician and talked to him a little bit about the car seat and he said it's totally up to you whenever you want to switch him from front to back uh he's totally safe as long as he's in a five point harness so i'm going to give it a try i'm going to switch the car seat from front from back facing to front facing to see if jackson likes it better tomorrow also, based on the recommendations from the car seat manufacturer, he is the right height and weight to switch him around to front facing. So let's go do it. All right, so this is the car seat that we have. This is the Britax One for Life. So we actually could have used this since he was a newborn because it will collapse down far enough to fit a newborn and it'll switch around so that it becomes front facing and then it'll eventually turn into just a booster for him. So I think we're gonna be sticking with this car seat for a while. We're gonna flip it around now and see how it fits, and I think I also have to connect it in the trunk too, to the back of the seats. All right, so I have it facing forward. This is the seat, it kind of goes down. I have to run all the seat belt and everything underneath there. But the first thing that I have to do is try to get it so that this little arrow here, it's kind of hard to see on video, but there's an arrow right there, it's in the green. So I think I'm there right now. I just have to see what happens when I run the seat belt through and tighten it down. All right, so I've got the seat belt run through here. My little arrow is right in the center of the green. I'm gonna try to fix this little cushiony part here. And then I just have to connect the back back here to the back of the chair, or the back of the seat. Doing pretty good. All right, there it is. All strapped in in the back back there. And then he is good to go up front here. I only got moderately sweaty, so not too bad. Just a little bit sweaty. <laughs> it's very hot in the garage. I feel like Jackson's gonna like that a lot better than facing backwards because he'll be able to look out the window. I don't know, he'll be able to look forward, see where we're going. I think he'll like car rides better now. All right, so we are done with dinner. Jackson's asleep, we've cleaned up. Mm -hmm. We brought in the stuff from the car from Target. <laughs> we figured we'd do a little Target haul. We wanted to show you all the fun summer stuff. They have all of their summer stuff is in stock, so. 
if you're looking for cute summer stuff, I think Target is a good place to look. Yeah. First things first, we got some stuff for the backyard to play with, like for Jackson to play with, for anybody that comes over to play with. So I told you earlier that we were going to have a friend um, come over tomorrow with their kids and they we ended up rescheduling for next weekend. Right. So we got some stuff for them to do next weekend. I'm very excited. So the first thing we got... This thing is so heavy. I don't know why. Like, it was... It's just all plastic. Okay. It is this... What is it called? It's the, the Surfing, Surfing Panda Play Center. I don't know how big this actually is. Like, I'm kind of curious of how, how tall is the slide, really. Right? I think it's pretty small. I would imagine that the slide is probably, like, two feet, maybe. Okay. It looks, like, shorter than the other slide that we that he uses for his other pool. Right. Which we were, we're still going to have that one out. I think what we're going to do next weekend is do, like, a little mini toddler water park in the backyard. Ooh. Like, won't that be fun? That sounds fun. I'm super excited. I don't... I think it's because Jackson's never had a friend come over to play. Right. So this is like a momentous occasion. Yeah. So I want it to be like amazing. I can't, I'm gonna call <laughs> right now and rent a cabana. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna, well, okay. So one of the things we are gonna do. Oh, wait, um, where's the other little thing? Oh, okay, I'll tell you in a second. It's over here. All right, so we just realized, and I think we kind of already knew this, but we forgot this camera that we normally use on home vlogs just cause it's easier, more portable. When we are in the kitchen, these lights give it like this flickering. Yeah, it's, it's weird. almost like it runs down the screen constantly. It's strange. It yeah. shouldn't be happening, but it does. Yeah, so we're going to use the big camera. Sorry, so we're switching yeah. over. So, the next thing that we got is this giant beach ball, giant beach ball sprinkler. So, it's this big beach ball and it has little sprinklers that kind of like come out of it on the sides and on the top. Look at these kids having so much fun. Right? That's going to be Jackson and his little friend next weekend. Oh, they're going to have a ball? I'm <laughs> that was my dad joke for the day. So the Surfing Panda Play Center was 40 bucks. The This beach ball was 20 bucks. So we also got, because I figure we will put out, if you remember our, I think it was Easter, our Easter vlog. Yeah. I'll link that down below if you haven't seen it. But we did, um, we put up like the, we have a sun, what do you call that? The easy up tent. Okay, it's like an easy up tent. It's like a cabana, sort of. Um, but I wanted to put a table because we're going to eat lunch and stuff. So I got this cute little tablecloth. Look at it. Look at the print. Like, how oh, fun. Yeah, pineapples. Super bright. Dragon fruit, papaya. Bananas. So this one is uh, 60 inches by 84 inches. So it's like a pretty big tablecloth. Yeah. And this is like a thicker one. So we can definitely reuse it, which is really nice. And this was six bucks. Yeah. We also got, and this is like home stuff, but we also got some more of that soap that we really like from Hand in Hand. That's so really it's good soap. Vegan, cruelty free, palm oil free. We got a new one. This is sea salt, eucalyptus, and mint. It smells super minty. It's very nice. And then this one we just we already use. We love it. It is cactus blossom, bergamot, and crisp basil. So I also got some dry shampoo. This is just good to have, and it's pretty inexpensive. Okay, so now we got some cute clothes. Wait, what? I want to show what I got. What? Oh, the hoses. Oh, <laughs> oh, the hoses. So because we're having this event in our backyard, <laughs> right. I had to up my hose game. I need more hoses to run these things that run off hoses. Well, because we're literally standing in the aisle and I was like, we only have one hose. Like, yeah. what are we going to do? So. so I got more hoses. <laughs> and a splitter. And two splitters. Oh, two splitters. Yeah. So this hose was $10. Nice. Got some splitters. Mm. The two-way valve was $9. Wow, that was pretty pricey. Pretty pricey for a two-way belt. Going to be worth it, though, because it is going to facilitate our, our toddler water park. Oh, yeah. So get ready for next weekend. I'm so excited. Me I can't too. Like, I literally can't wait. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh, oh, another thing that I got was I got a second hose. <laughs> well, what's cooler than a guy with two hoses? Oh, well, nothing. <laughs> Nothing's cooler than a guy with two hoses. <laughs> um, Okay, so we also got Jackson some fun summer clothes. Uh, I'm very excited about the clothes that we got for Jackson because they're super cool. They're so cute. Target has the cutest clothes. I feel like they're a bit pricey, but I just, I really like them. So we got him this fun shirt. It is a dinosaur. It's a T-Rex doing rock wall. Is that what it is? Yeah, he's climbing oh, a rock wall. Oh, okay. I was trying to figure out what he was doing. Okay, that one was $4.50. We got him some jean shorts because he doesn't have any jean shorts. 
some nice shorts in there. Yeah, these were ten ten dollars. Yeah, shorts oh. are a little bit more expensive than shirts. Okay, um, we got this one. I think is so cute. Tim picked it out. This one was also four fifty. It's Look a T Rex made out of flowers. Isn't that? I feel like this will be the next time we go to Flower and Garden, which is ending soon. Um, he can wear that. That would oh, yeah. be cute. I picked this one out. This one's another four fifty, but it's like a little, like the planets, the sun, the solar system. All the planets are like playing baseball. Cute, right? Yeah. Is one of them like studying? I don't know. I can't. I, I don't know. One of them is doing looking up space space facts. <laughs> oh, we got him another pair of. These are six dollar shorts. Well, those are nice. Yeah, I thought these were fun. They're easy on, easy off. We got him some little tank tops for summer. Tanky toppies. No, why are the tank tops six dollars and the t-shirts with sleeves are four fifty? Well, because of style. What's up with that? This is another one, six dollars. I just like the color. I love yellow. Um, that was a two T, so it'll be a little bit bigger for him to grow into. Yeah. This one we thought was so adorable. It says surf and play until the end of the day, and it's a little dinosaur surfing. Heck yeah. This one was also six dollars. I like a good dinosaur themed shirt haul. <laughs> he has a lot of dinosaur stuff. It's funny, so when we were first doing his nursery, we thought we were going to do a dinosaur themed nursery. Right. That was like our, our initial... So if you remember when we first were like doing the nursery stuff, we were looking at wallpaper. Oh yeah. And the wallpaper that we looked at had dinosaurs on it. Yeah. And then we ended up, we were like, this might be too dark. It was kind of very busy. If I can find a picture of it, I'll, I'll put it up here for you to see. It was super cool, but it was, we ended up going with the, the ocean theme, the water theme and instead. And we never ended up getting wallpaper at all. I know. Yeah, I'm kind of- That's what started it all, was going and looking at wallpaper. I know, well, no, we, we got it up, we got a sample online and then it, it came and we were like, oh, maybe not. Yeah. <laughs> so always get a sample. And then lastly, or no, I don't think this is lastly. Nextly, we got a this little outfit. With, it's like a set? Yeah, it's a little tank top with like some surfboards and then some little shorts that are, they're kind of like that raw edge short. So this oh. is like a cute, a cute little. Like for the beach. And this one was $16. I think this one was a little bit pricey, but it was very cute. Oh wait, we got one more thing for Jackson. This is something he'll have to grow into. This is that shirt that we said, he'll grow into it. Yeah. <laughs> this one was $9. So I think that'll be really fun for him. Um, another thing that I got, the, so, okay, something that's really popular right now is like sets. So they have these, like, can you tell what it is? It's just like a big, like a sweatshirt, like an oversized kind of a, but it's not, it's like a thick shirt. Oh, it has thumb holes. Oh, thumb holes. That's fun. And pockets. Pockets, pockets in your shirt. Yeah, that's pretty fun. And then I also got the matching shorts to go with it. And these are fun. They're like a like a muted kind of an orangey color. So I found out how to do a tie dye like this. I'm oh, like did into tie dye. You really are. <laughs> you uh you use shaving cream. Oh really? Yeah. What do you mean? I have to look exactly how to do it. Yeah. But what? like you you put shaving cream all over it and then then you dye around it, I guess, and it makes it kind of like creamy looking like Blotchy this. Watchy looking? Yeah. Really? Yeah, okay, so it's just like a... Looks kind of sporty. I mean, it kind of feels sporty. You know how sporty clothes have that like different, like stretchiness to it? Feel that. So also when we were at Disney the other day, we saw this cute like Mickey version one with stars and little Mickey heads and then the matching shorts. So I got this set as well when we were at Disney. So I feel like I'm just gonna be like comfortable girl summer. Oh yeah. You know? Comfortable girl summer, that's the new, new hotness. That's what we're doing. Does the, does the Mickey one have pockets? Um, it does. In, in the, the pit, shirt? Not in the shirt. Not in the shirt, no. Boo. And this one was a, a little bit more expensive than the one from Target. And the one from Target is actually feels nicer. How much was the one from Target? It was 24 for each piece. Oh, okay. Yeah, the one from Disney was uh, 34 for the shorts and then 44 for the shirt. Right. So I feel like go to Target. Yeah. <laughs> it's a lot cheaper and it feels better. Um. And they had it in other colors too. They had this really beautiful like taupe one, but they didn't have my size. So, so yeah, so that's everything. Oh, I also got this, um, I also got this like romper. It's a skirt set. I didn't realize that like skirts are back in. Skirt. Yeah, it's like a skirt on the front and then like shorts in the back. Okay. So. Skirt. 
I, I just didn't realize that they were back in. I just remember wearing them when I was in like middle school. This one was $25, which for this kind of a thing, I feel like is a pretty good deal. So that was everything we got from Target. Yeah. Yeah. I'm happy with my hoses. I'm, <laughs> I'm really happy with all the stuff we got for Jackson. Um, I'm going to wash it tonight so that he can wear something tomorrow. Heck yeah. Because we are going to go over to our friends for breakfast. I'm excited for tomorrow. I'm excited for next weekend. I'm just excited for summer, you know? Yeah. So. Except for the heat. But now we have our cool summer clothes and our cool, like... I bought my cool hoses. <laughs> you also have your cool hat. I got my cool hat, yeah. Yeah. So. It's all you need. What, what else do you need in life? That's the two hoses and a hat. <laughs> we also have our surfing panda play center. So we're just, we're good to go, you know? Yeah. yeah. I'm going to get a bigger slide for adults. So in our first house, we actually had a slide. When we first bought the house, it had a slide. And then we couldn't get the house insured with the slide. So we had to take the slide out before we could like actually get insurance for the house. Yeah. I was so sad. We kept the slide for the longest time thinking like, maybe we'll put it back up. We never did. We had to like chop the slide into a million pieces and throw it away. Yeah. But um, I would love to have a slide in the pool. I don't think we can. No, we can't. But, but, I, but I would like that. Be pretty fun. <laughs> so all in all, it was a fantastic day. It was. It was nice to just be able to get some things done. And um, I hope you guys will tune in next weekend. I hope you guys tune in next week. Yeah. Hope you guys tune in the week after that. And I hope you guys tune in tomorrow. Yeah. So all in all, a fantastic day. And with that being said, we are off. We'll see you all tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price.